There's a massive, massive push for accessibility now online. And Squarespace are doing their very best to be right at the front when it comes to accessibility. And one thing that they've allowed us to do for quite a while is add alt text to images, but they've also allowed us now to add a alt text to a few other areas where we weren't actually able to add it prior. So I'm gonna show you in this video quickly how to add alt text into like an image block and then also how to add it into a list section. So you join me here on my site. I think every video this week I'm on my site, but you know, may as well show it off. So to edit uh, alt text on your images, you want to click on edit on whatever page that you want to go in. And then you want to find your image and you're going to double click it here. You can then see we have the alt text here and it's also good practice. So I'm led to believe to do the file name in a similar format as well. So you can see here it describes uh, what I am. To be honest, this one is more so for SEO. But if we were to go down to these here, in a list section, you go edit content, content, the item, and then you can add um, the alt text here. This again is the file names, probably not the best. I would say maybe uh, I would describe this as screenshot of Dame Kelly Holmes trust website home oh can't spell website home page so that's where you can add the alt text for your list sections and you can also me see me tidy your mind up as well so that's how i describe that again if we scroll down 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 you can see image you just got to double click and then you can see image alt text this one is a little bit better an example squarespace web design project you can see these are Squarespace web design projects. So if you're in a blog, for instance, let's go into there and I'll show you what I mean. We go into pages, we find our blog like so, and then we've got all of our blog content. So head into the blog content. This is my uh, post from last week. Hit edit. And then have we got any images in here? Okay, so we've got a screenshot here and this is gonna be adding a border around the Squarespace hamburger menu. What am I doing in the image? I'm adding a border around the Squarespace hamburger menu. So just be really descriptive with it. All you're gonna do is double click an image, add the alt text in there. As for a list section, which I showed you then, edit content, go into the content on the uh, content item. You can add the alt text there. So that's that, hopefully you found it useful. If you did, please make sure to leave a like and hit subscribe. And if you want me to build your Squarespace website, you can get in touch using the links in the description.